This is the distinctively styled CHR hybrid with all of its lovely curves and lines and sinews. But before we get into the styling of this car, I want to talk about what's underneath the skin because it's really clever. It is, of course, a self-charging hybrid. And what that means is it doesn't have a plug, but it does have an engine and a large electric motor, which is capable of driving the car on its own. It's that powerful and a large bank of batteries below the rear seats so they don't impede on any rear legroom or boot space. This car drives really efficiently, produces very low levels of CO2 and NOx as well. So this is an efficient, quiet, refined car no matter where you drive it. And the batteries are lithium ion, so that means that they're light and they charge up quickly and they deliver charge really quickly too. We've also included quite a lot of sound insulation in the CHR. Things like insulation over the wheel arches and under the bonnet and in around the door frames. Just look at the styling of it. The side profile, that silhouette, the way the car looks like a coupe even though it's an SUV, that's distinctively CHR. The front headlights are LED and we have LED daytime running lights and we also have fog lights here as well. And as you can see, we've seamlessly integrated front and rear parking sensors into the bumper of the CHR. The other thing we've integrated behind the scenes is radar in behind the Toyota badge here and a camera in the top of the windscreen. And that's because you get a whole host of safety features as standard with the CHR. Things like road sign assist, adaptive cruise control and pedestrian detection, to name just a few. As we move our way around to the back, you'll see that we have 18 inch alloy wheels on the sport grade. We also have them on Luna Sport and Sol. And that's one of the great things about having a hybrid because we have such an efficient car, we can afford to put larger, better styled alloys on it. And we don't sacrifice fuel efficiency or CO2. The rear styling of the CHR is just as distinctive as the front. We have this lovely high gloss black painted bar that runs all the way from one tail light to the other. We have, of course, our spoiler with an integrated brake light in it as well. And the back is sculpted and defined. It's really modern looking. As we open up the boot, we'll see that we have a reversing camera very neatly tucked in below the boot lip so you don't see it from behind the car. It's integrated seamlessly. And then we've got loads of boot space. This is a nice wide boot. We don't have any wheel arches encroaching in on our space. It's deep and it's tall. And if you want to fold the rear seats, it's as simple as pulling a flap and letting them down. Putting them back up is a cinch too. They're lovely and light. This is a very practical SUV. As if the sport grade wasn't jam packed full of equipment enough, moving over to our sole grade, we get a few changes here too. So we have full LED headlights for low and high beam. And you see this lovely daytime running light that switches to be the indicator when you switch the indicator on. How cool is that? You also get LED front fog lights and around the side, different style alloy wheels. These are multi-spoke black machine face wheels. They look fantastic, particularly set against this white body color. That's one of my favorite things about the CHR. No matter which version you choose, you get a different style wheel and a different interior. And then around the back, the rear lights are full LED as well. And you get the same sequential indicator light running across the rear lights. That's a really premium feature. Despite the CHR looking very coupe-like on the outside, there's loads of headroom. So the back doesn't rake down sharply. You still get lots of space back here. I stand at six feet tall. I've put the driver's seat in a position that's comfortable for me to drive. And I have loads of knee room. This is a very comfortable place to sit. And you also get a cup holder back here too. Our Luna Sport and Sol grades also feature a thing called Smart Entry. You have the key, have it in your pocket, hold the door handle, and hey presto, it opens up. This is the interior of the Sol, so you get half leather seats, very plush, and they really cosset you nicely into the seat with these very supportive bolsters on the side. The Sol also comes with a few added safety features like a blind spot monitor, and it can even park itself thanks to its intelligent park assist. It's really clever if you don't fancy getting in and out of tight car parking spaces. It'll do it for you. 
And because this is a self-charging hybrid where you don't need a plug, you also don't need to change gears because we've got an automatic transmission as standard as well. We also have our heating control systems here set into this lovely high gloss piano black finish. And we have our eight inch Toyota touch screen with physical hard buttons. So it makes navigating through the menus really easy. This model has sat nav as standard, but all CHRs come with Apple CarPlay. So it's as easy as putting your phone into a USB, connecting it up, and letting the system do the rest. I've got supported apps here, things like Spotify and Google Maps. So you can always know where you're going, you can listen to your favorite tunes, sit back, relax, and enjoy a very comfortable drive. So if you're looking for an SUV that is practical, stylish, and charismatic, or you want something that's refreshingly easy to drive and efficient, then the CHR is for you.